All right, everybody, this is Matthew Doinyaman. Kill Patrick Ryoka. I'm going to go outside. I'll, uh, I am in this. We are, Brother Dowie's with me. We are in this blizzard. Okay. I want you to begin to see how brutal this is. This, these winds are 40 miles an hour guaranteed. Now, the book of Hebrews chapter 12 talks a lot about the shaking and the quaking. This is a shaking and a quaking. This blizzard is coming from about, and I don't want to point in that direction because I don't want to reveal too much of where I am. Although I am in far upstate New York. I'm talking far upstate New York. Uh, close to the Canadian borders you could possibly get me. I ain't going to tell you the exact location, but look, I mean, the book of Hebrews talks about a shaking and a quaking. That what in, in us, through trials and tribulations, what can be shaken will be shaken, and what will remain will be remain. And that is much like 1 Corinthians chapter 3, verse 15, about wood, hay, and stubble, rather than and, and burning off, than wood and gold, silver, and precious stones remaining and we are being saved as through fire. But a lot of you might not realize the Hebrew word ruach means the wind. But with the wind could come the fire ablaze. Because with the Holy Spirit also is fire. But in the book of Acts, chapter 2, remember 120 were in the upper room. And the kind of shaking that you see here in far upstate New York was going on, but fear filled the house and smoke filled the house. And then they were filled with the Holy Spirit. And I want you all to take this uh, blizzard. I know this is weather manipulation. I know that this is controlled by harp and, and all the other evil nor, you know, no NORAD towers, all that. I know it, but I would still take this storm very seriously. And don't get your wood, get your get your heater, buddy. If you don't have firewood, just make sure you stay safe. I'm not even going to show my face, but I'm going to tell you what. I've been on here three minutes, and I'm going to tell you what. In five minutes, your hand, even with normal gloves on could feel like they're falling off. I'm going to suggest you wear glove liners. I forgot to bring the pair of um, mitts that I have uh, for the fireplace. But mitts will actually stop your hand from freezing. I'm going to just want to remind you of Hebrews chapter 12, 1 Corinthians chapter 3, and Acts chapter 2, and all the, what the prophets said about the shaking. And uh, I believe that... Uh, this uh, impending world war coming to America is within weeks. Uh, keep, stay warm, stay faithful, and endure to the end. And it's going to be a shalom, shalom. And I don't celebrate Christmas, so I'm not going to tell you Merry Christmas or Happy Hanukkah. I'm just going to tell you endure to the end. Matthew 24, signing out.